All right, here we are again at DS1 Studios, and we're here again for another lesson, part two of Open Major Chords. All right, we're going to discuss the Open Major G chord and both different methods of it. Um, there's something noted in the three finger, uh, well, the three finger method and there's the four finger method. Um, both methods are pretty common. Uh, all right, guys, here we are. This is the three finger method. Um, you're going to want to take your middle finger here and place it on the third fret of your E string. You're going to take your index finger and place it on the second fret of your A string. You're then going to take your pinky and place it on the third fret of your bottom E. And you should get this. Or with a more cleaner tone. Now with the four finger method, you just simply add the fourth finger to your the third fret of your B string which gives you as you can see the difference it kind of adds a little more color there to the chord all right guys here's the C major on this one you're going to want to take your uh, ring finger here and place it on the third fret of your A string. You're going to take your middle finger and place it on the second fret of the D string. And you're going to take your index finger here and place it on the very first fret of your B string. That gives you... C major. Okay, the last chord we're covering here is the F major, and that would be the, you take your, uh, your index finger here, and bar off your first E string and your B string on the first fret. You're going to take your ring finger and place it on the second fret of your G string. You are going to take your, uh, ring finger here and place it on the third fret of your D string and ultimately that should give you the F major alright folks that concludes our video for open major chords uh, keep checking in and if you haven't subscribed please do